Hello officials, welcome back to this channel, and if you're new here, I'm Lewis, and this is officially Lewis. Now, yeah, y'all didn't get no video like last week, y'all y'all ain't get one. When I tell y'all I needed that break, I needed that break, because finals were this week, and I still got some more la next week, but the finals this week were, oh my goodness, it almost took me for a loop. Oh, I, I don't even understand, I don't understand it. All this time we put, like, they put us through school all, I mean, they put us through all these works and quizzes and stuff all the whole year. And at the end of the year, now it's not a year semester, but still, at the end of it, they give you these hard quizzes that you barely even learn anything on it. Like, they really, they really sit up here and put stuff that they didn't teach on there. But hey, we're not here to get into my rant about that, but if y'all would like to rant about that, let me know. Because I'll post a story time video. I'll sit up here and rant about the whole school and education and all that but hey we're not here for that we're here for for now <laughs> but anyways before we get into that i would like to show y'all something so one of one of the officials submitted some fan art so i will gladly pop it up on screen right now it is from miley millie art on youtube and mighty talk mighty two one sorry on tiktok now if i hope i gotta add a section on here for pronunciation because i feel like I'm, if I messed up the name, I'm so sorry, but I, it, yeah, <laughs> anyways, 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 thank you so much for your submission, and if you guys have any fan art that you guys want to like to submit, it's always in my link, so there's a link down below you can submit it on, just it's in my link tree, or it's on my YouTube channel itself, you can click that link and submit your fan art there, and don't worry, there's a section called legit fan art, <laughs> so yeah, anyways, but yeah, back to what we're doing, but no, 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 not before we go there. I would love to say thank you because like I remember when I first got it like I went to, I just checked I went to check and I saw and I was like oh what's this clicked on it I was like oh yeah I forgot about these clicked on clicked on the first one and I saw that I was so oh my goodness I loved it so much I loved it so much it really made my whole entire week like I, I really appreciate it don't oh my goodness I, I thank you so much <laughs> <laughs> anyways 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 and I did get your suggestion and I will be putting it into my list of a video to do, videos to do but thank you for the suggestion so I cannot wait to do it um, there are a couple videos I'm going to be doing beforehand because they're scheduled but when I do get to it I cannot wait to do it because that is a really good idea thank you so much anyways other than that so now we're going to hop into FNAF 2 redesign but it's going to be split up into three parts so the first part is the um so part one is the toys part two is the withers and part three will be the extras so we're doing part one today and part one consists of toy freddy toy bonnie toy chica and toy foxy or aka mango and yeah so with that being said be sure you guys like this video comment down how y'all feel about the series and what how y'all feel this video is going to turn out and definitely subscribe and send the video to all your friends yeah <laughs> anyways 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 make sure you guys do all those and let's go ahead and just jump into today's video okay so when it came to drawing this version of freddy uh thanks to you guys who voted in both polls we'll be doing the bulks like the bulk video where i do all characters at a time and and I'm also doing a creepy style, as you can see right now. So yeah, thank you guys for voting. I really appreciate it. But when it came, when it came to drawing this version of Toy Freddy, I definitely took a lot of inspiration from um, this version of Chuck E. Cheese. I'm gonna pop it up the screen for y'all so you can see. But I took a lot of inspiration from that Chuck E. Cheese and just gave it more vibrant colors and more, you know, make it more like toy friendly. Obviously, there's not a lot of like, there's not a hair out of place or rough hair edges like how I did in the first one because in this version I wanted to make it like more slick and clean because in this version I even though they still a little bit dirty and you know dark and it's in the dark room obviously but I want to make sure it was like not nice and smooth and stuff to give it that more polished feel because these are at, at the end of the day these are still toys but yeah I really like it he really does remind me of the old Chuck E. Cheese 
Like, I, I really, I really love it. Speaking of which, which Chuck E. Cheese is y'all favorite? Because my personal favorite is the one before this version. Because I don't know why this version now, the, today's version, they took away the animatronics. And not me personally, I just feel like that's the whole point of going. But anyways, let's move on to the next person. Okay, so yeah, now we're doing Toy Chica, and honestly, I love it. I love the creepy aspect that it gave. So, I honestly wasn't sure where to start with Toy Chica, but then as I was looking at the old design of her that I did last video, I decided to give her more, since I gave the last one pig, uh, a ponytail, I decided to give this one twins, uh, space buns or twin buns, and honestly, I love it so much. I don't know why, but it just fits so perfectly. And then the face, it just gave so much creepiness. I just loved it. I really did love it. Then I decided to give a crop top, um, shorts, and an undershirt, an under tank top. And then I decided to put her in some roller skates because honestly, honestly, it, it fits for Toy Chicas for some reason. It does, it does. I really do love it though. I love, I love Toy Chicas design, I do. I really do, I really do. And yes, honestly, the skates and the uh, space buns was actually inspired from my friend who do, who did uh, a Chica design too. And honestly, I just got inspired from her because I was like, yeah, it, for some reason, space buns just fits for Chica. I don't know. I don't know why, but it did. Dud, it did. Then I also decided to build a party out of her because her shirt says let's party. And honestly, I, I didn't see the fit for a cupcake for her. So I also put a present on on inner hand and if y'all can tell you know i won't say i won't say until we get to the color and perfect if y'all if y'all could tell y'all could tell <laughs> anyways anyways i do love the overall design too because it just fits so perfectly but one thing i did notice and my friend told me i was wrong for saying it but like one thing i did notice about this version of chica and the last version of chica they both look like middle-aged women trying to be all young and hip y'all know what i mean yeah i know i know all y'all know exactly what i mean when i say that <laughs> And I found out that sounds so mean. I know it sounds so mean. But anyways, do y'all recognize what I did with the prison? Yep. Yeah, mm -hmm, yeah. <laughs> I just gave it the puppet's box for, uh, colors because you know the puppet is in this version. And I'm not even sure if I'm gonna make puppet in this version in this um rewrite right here. Not well, I already did. So I'm not sure if I'm gonna do it again. Same with Golden Freddy because Golden Freddy is technically old already, so he didn't get no fix up. So I'm not doing Golden Freddy. I know that for a fact, but I'm not sure if I'm gonna do, redo Puppet. I'll think about it. I'll think about it. Honestly, I love the pu Puppet's design, so I don't think I'm gonna redo Puppet. But yeah. Anyways, let me know what y'all think of Chica. Let me know exactly what y'all think of her. Okay, so I think that a lot of y'all may not like what I did with Toy uh, Toy Bonnie, but as you gotta see, I did a whole gender swap. <laughs> I did a whole gender swap. So since last the last Toy Bonnie, I was like, you know what? I was like, cause um, if y'all ever watched those, it's they're old videos, but if you ever watched those MMD videos, there was just one of Toy Bonnie where they made her uh, Toy Bonnie a girl. And they put her in this school girl, elf, school girl outfit. It's not even school girl outfit, more like a. Uh, it's a basic, you know, plaited skirt, sweater, and then a collar shirt, right? And then a tie. So I was like, you know what? Just to pay a little tribute to that, I was like, let me go ahead and put my toy Bonnie in that. And honestly, I think it worked out. I think it worked out pretty good. I loved it, honestly, I do. And yeah, that's really all I can say about toy Bonnie. It's not really that much to her. Um yeah <laughs> i did i do like the little um little puffs on her end of her on, on the end of her ears i do love that but yeah definitely let me know what y'all think of toy bonnie's new design and yeah let me know
Okay, people. Okay, so yeah, now we're finally on Mango, and honestly, oh, I can. I'm. Just, oh my goodness, this one took me the longest. It it really did, because. <laughs> Man, I don't even know what to say about this one. So, I decided to go more with the she and well in this in this story I'm building with uh, this FNAF redesign. I'm going with the story that she's not a pirate, but she is the um caretaker or not caretaker, but she's more of the um you know the party host. Uh, what you call it in those private rooms? She's like that animatronic that'll be in those rooms. So. What I did where was just, you know, soften up her clothing and stuff and all that. But the one thing I made sure I made sure to do was I based her off of those moms, them new moms. I based her off of them new moms and all the new mothers know exactly what I mean. Once you see the end of this, their their clothing is torn up. They got spots and spills all over their clothing. They got children and uh, like, they look a mess. OK, and hey, hey, new moms. Shout out to all the new moms because, oh, I, I just know. Oh, I pray for y'all. Anyways, so yeah, I decided to give her more of this. Um, you start to see in a minute, but I started giving her this more ruined feel. Her hair's a mess. Her um, clothes are ripped. Like, oh, and then I also decided to add like a lot of like, since, you know, Mango was mainly around children, I decided to draw all over her dress and add a whole bunch of like stickers googly eyes like a whole bunch on her dress like as if cute children were obviously like sticking and coloring on her so i wanted to make sure i added all that and i still want to add that whole torn up feeling to her like she was she been oh she been through it now after since now that i got the explanation out the way let's written hikey y'all let's really talk about how fazbear entertainment was really letting these children take apart and put back together this expensive animatronic that could really hurt somebody. I mean, and they allow, and this the fact that the parents allow it, because I know the parents be in the party rooms, right? Like, not like obviously we're in the game, obviously, but like, hear me out, right? So like, you mean to tell me that you as a parent will let your child go up to an animatronic, take it apart, and then re put it back together? Do you understand? Look at Mangle. Look at her. You mean tell me you let your child go touch it? Uh, all the kids are the all the kids are playing with her. Can we go do? Do you not see how? And it's exposed wires to and everything. Like I just, <laughs> never understood that. Never understood that. <laughs> but anyways, anyways, let me know what y'all think of Mangle and definitely let me know what y'all think about her because I took the most time on her and I really like to hear y'all opinions on her. But yeah, definitely let me know and we can go ahead and let this whole video play out the rest. Ah! Let me sit up, let me sit up. <laughs> I love it. <laughs> I do love it. I love it so much. Oh, so how do y'all feel about how y'all feel about the toys so far? How do y'all feel about them? Let me know down below because I really do love hearing and re I said hearing. I really said hearing. <laughs> I do I love reading and replying to all of y'all comments. I love it so much because it lets me know that y'all like the series. So yeah. <laughs> but yeah, definitely comment down how y'all feel about each um, design, what y'all feel about them, how y'all feel about them, and all that. Honestly, honestly, I love it so far, and I cannot wait to start expanding it out. Like, oh, oh, I just love it. I just love it. I do. Oh, this is, I, I need to get my roses. Give me my roses. Yeah, give it here. <laughs> but anyways, 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 thank y'all so much for watching. I really appreciate it, and I love all the support and love to the channel, and I, I thank y'all so much, and I love y'all. I love all y'all, seriously. And thank you so much for the fan art. I love it so much. Oh, I can't stop looking at it. I love it so much. And if you have any fan art for me of my Artsona, 
be sure to uh, go down below into the description and and in my link tree link on the page on it'll, it'll bring up a page on the page there's a section called fan art so you can most definitely go through it fill it out and submit your fan art of me and if you have any OC designs that you like to, for me to draw my style there's also there's also a section for that and if you have any story times which will always be anonymous unless you make yourself known um it'll be also linked down below too and if you just need some advice or whatever but yeah those are like it's all gonna be linked down below for y'all so yeah go ahead and check it out and yeah overall i'm just happy i really am i love the fan art and i love how everyone came out i, I just love it i just love it so definitely comment down and let me know how much y'all love it too or if y'all have any criticism or advice let come go ahead and let me know let me know <laughs> but overall thank y'all so much for watching i really appreciate it and if you stay tuned to the end love y'all love y'all go ahead and bow for you because you you're going to receive these roses with me thank you for staying tuned to the end <laughs> but no seriously thank y'all so much and honestly i guess i'll catch y'all next time bye